he's slipped into quite a funk here, Clark. I think that's a good word to describe it. I mean, the basket is looking awfully small to him at the moment. They grab their own miss. Rodman no good. The Bulls leading by four. Now here's Rose, the fast break opportunity. Tries again, Gasol. Heinrich outside. There's the triple. Here's Gibson. Oh, and there's the one-handed jam. Up and in with force after the offensive rebound. I like that tenacity. Yeah, he is so sturdy. He just battles for every rebound. To the paint. Here's Heinrich, and he uses the glass on the layup. Heinrich's got the lead up to eight now for Chicago. They have repeatedly probed inside in the first half, guys, and it's paid dividends. Yeah, it sure has, Clark. I mean, with, with as many points as they've gotten in the paint, they really haven't had to do much on the perimeter. I'm not sure what he was thinking there. That's embarrassing. You think? I mean, come on now. Doesn't he realize there's a game going on here? And it's going to be out of bounds. The Bulls will take it. Boy, just a brain cramp, guys. I mean, that should have been the simplest of exchanges. Luke Longley's checked in for Chicago. Harper comes in for Kukoc. Here's Kerr. And out of bounds as the Bulls gain possession. And we're about two minutes into the second quarter here. Rose, no good. Not able to find it here in the second. He's off stride and off track just a bit after that one he had earlier. Here's Butler. And it's going to be out of bounds. The Bulls will take it. Here's Harper. Clark, they've been looking out of sync offensively. You know what? A basket here would do a lot for their confidence. Rodman, no luck. Chicago leading by eight. Rose in the post. Rodman on him. He gives them a double-digit lead. Rose has got five now. And he may be the guy to put this game even farther out of reach. Time called here. The Bulls decide to talk it over. And as with any timeout at this point of the game, important to go over the strategies that are working and those that are needed in terms of adjustments. And of course, the opportunity, guys, to get hydrated with Gatorade before coming back out of the floor. We've seen some good action so far, and there's, there's more of it to come. Yeah, this game has been physical. It's been fast. It's been high-paced. So anytime you're in a situation like this where it's really a hard-fought game, critical to keep yourself hydrated throughout. Here's Pippen. Boy, for a guy 6'8 to move like that, Pippen, so impressive. He's so reliable. You know, his offense seems to be consistently there for this team. And the first time out of the game called for Chicago. Chicago making some changes. Sally, he's checked in for Longley. Bushler comes in for Pippen. And Michael Jordan subbed in for Ron Harper. Joakim Noah is checked in for the Bulls. Brooks comes in for Kirk Heinrich. Here's Brooks. And the layup is good. Brooks has got his second bucket tonight. Every time they get scored on during this run, it's come from inside the paint. 
Right, you got to make a defensive adjustment here, Clark. Time to collapse inside, force the ball back out in the perimeter, make them beat you from long range. And oh, here we go. Brooks got it. The fast break chance. That's good. Brooks has got eight. They are not rotating nearly quickly enough on defense down low. Got to get quicker there. And even if it costs them some foul trouble, I mean, they need to start putting some bodies on bodies. Be physical. Well, it's the edge they've had in that area on the glass that's played a big role in this game. Yeah, they've got some strong guys, Steve. Guys that are strong and well put together, and they've used that strength to their advantage down low. Chicago shooting their fifth and sixth free throws of the game. Both free throws good from Gasol. Here's Jordan. 19 points in the game. Pass break. Here comes Chicago. Rose with the ball. Let's go now to the sideline and catch up with Doris Burke. Hey, Doris. Well, Kevin, Pau Gasol made a big move this summer to join the Chicago Bulls. He was courted by a number of teams, but went with his instinct. He sees the Bulls as a team that can compete for a title, saying without a doubt, it is one of the championship favorites in the East alongside Cleveland. We'll see how far they go, guys. We will indeed. Thank you, Doris. Chicago calls timeout. He needs to get them back into a flow offensively. You know, things have gotten stagnant for them, and they're starting to force some of these shots. And that can snowball on you. One guy takes a bad shot, then another guy does, and then you're missing back-to-back-to-back -to -back -to -back shots, and all of a sudden, you have no rhythm and you're self-inflicting wounds. Their offense seems completely out of sync here. They're on the wrong end of a big run. And then at the other end, it's been bucket after bucket after bucket, giving up a huge run here. Brooks against Kerr, takes a three, and it's rejected. And he recovers it. If he can improve on what's been a shaky day for him thus far, they could stretch this lead out. Sally, no good off the front iron. Yeah, that's a low percentage shot right there. Yeah, it sure is. I mean, he's got to be thinking out there a little better. Make the pass in that situation. Don't force a bad shot. And he's shaking off a poor first quarter shooting effort. He's really starting to turn it on now, guys. The drive by Jordan. Stolen by Noah. And here we go, the Bulls, fast break. And that one's good, Brooks. Again, lackluster transition defense. And you know, seven of the last 10 points, Steve, they've given up have been off the fast break. So it's pretty easy to see the problem. Now you gotta do something to correct it. Boy, they're getting a bunch more threes up here in the second quarter. Yeah, a little trigger happy here, Clark. And you can't win the game with one shot. You gotta vary it up and challenge the defense inside. Outside Rose from deep three-point range and out of bounds as the Bulls gain possession. Chicago making some changes. Wennington is checked in for Rodman. Simpkins comes in for Sally. And it's Kukoc in for Bushler. Chicago also making some changes. Miritich is checked in for Gasol. And it's Etwan Moore checking in for Rose. Here's Miritich, and he was fouled in the act of shooting. Chance here now for a three-point play. You know, when he's in that tight with that kind of height advantage over the defender, that's going to be a pretty easy play for him. And here's Jordan outside. Miracic grabs the miss. Butler goes in. One second left. Got it to go with no time left. And through one half, it hasn't even been close. It's the Bulls opening up at... Welcome back, everybody. Third quarter just about to get going here in what has been so far a runaway game. Jordan having a terrific game. He's got 21 points and one steal. How about this stat, guys? He's actually scored more than half their points all by himself. Well, this could go beyond the double-team situation, fellas. Maybe they need to triple-team this guy. So for Chicago right now, Heinrich and Rose, the guards. Ends out at the four and five are Gasol and Noah. And it's Butler in at the three. The Bulls have made six of their seven attempts at the line in this one. And not a very strong free throw shooting team in general. Guys, they shot 73% as a team a year ago. And so he's able to get one of two. And three from Jordan. They get it back outside for Pippen. 
Passes it to Rodman. And some nice ball movement here by Chicago. And three from Jordan. Jordan can't get that one to fall. Here's Chicago. And here come the Bulls again. Chicago with the fast break. Good. Heinrich's got nine. Yeah, he put himself in great position to finish that break off, guys. Yep, right to the rack. Still a bit chilly from the field at the start of this third quarter. One of four so far. Gasol kicks to butt. And foul called as he misses. He'll go to the line and shoot two. That's his first personal foul. The Bulls have gone seven of nine from the free throw line tonight. The free throw drops for Butler. And so Butler nails both of them. Second half rolling along now. About a minute played here. Shoots. Harper, no good. Boy, they've really dominated on the glass. And, of course, they've done a lot of good things here tonight. But the rebounds have played a major factor. Hey, Steve. You know, rebounding always one of the key barometers in determining the victor. Oh, man, they are just putting the hammer down right now. <laughs> Defensively and offensively, it has all been working for them today. Kevin, I didn't like that defensive effort at all, but they are lucky he missed it. Yeah, they were uh, very lucky defensively because there was some miscommunication there. They left him wide open. The kick outside to Butler. A three-pointer off the mark. Tough three-point try there with a hand in his face. Boy, you'd be lucky to make that one against great defense. And that's out of bounds. Chicago will retain possession. 18 seconds on the shot clock. 18. From deep, Jordan. It seems like nothing is falling for him this quarter. He's really out of his rhythm. That doesn't go either for Jordan. Offensive rebound. Guys, we've seen a lot of turnovers in this one. Yeah, it's been really sloppy out there. I understand that they're trying to be aggressive, but still, I mean, you can play fast, but still play efficiently, but they're not doing that right now. Here's Noah. And again, Chicago, no good. Chicago with the ball to halt the run, tries to save it, and nothing but hair on that one. It just hasn't been a very good day for him, guys. They need him to start burying some of those. From deep, Rose. The Bulls keep it alive. The kick outside to Butler. And the Bulls with another miss. He's normally a really big threat from long range. Struggling right now, he might need to mix his game up a little bit. Pippen's gotten only four of his 11 shots to fall here so far. Three-pointer. Butler can't get that one to fall. Very little success for him behind the arc today. Just one three-pointer in the first half and still none in the second. And the officials call a traveling violation. Mm, big blunder there, and that could cost them. Major blunder, and you're right. A terrible time for that to happen when they're trying to chip away at this deficit. Bushler's checked in for the Bulls. Kerr comes in for Ron Harper. Chicago also making some changes. Taj Gibson's checked in for Noah. Miritich comes in for Butler. And Brooks subbed in for Derrick Rose. Bushler. From deep. Chicago grabs the miss. Gibson's got his fifth rebound right now in the game. 
Chicago making some changes. Wennington, he's checked in for Longley. Simpkins comes in for Rodman. And it's Kukoc in for Pippen.